just got this drink. Bottle. So I know I'm gonna be thirsty when I get leave the mate and stuff. After I don't know if it's just made normal or weird or whatever, but generally after about an hour of not drinking water, I actually begin to feel dehydrated. So I thought I'll mention that. So now we play the waiting game. So. Right. Pass the time somehow. Passing the time somehow. So in updates thus far, that um <coughs> that Reddit account um <coughs> fucking cigarettes um that thing with the Reddit account hasn't fucked up so it's a good idea so use it like that until fucking further notice. Um, But but and then that, that girl is just yeah it it just I don't know why but it just could have done but the uh nothing bad happens to see it's, like, I think I'm talking to a brick, I think that's what got to me, I was talking like a brick wall. But, so, yeah, so, yeah, but, so, like, yeah, you're playing game. Fucking winter time. Fucking with this shit too. <sighs> Zero people are around. I don't know why I could have been at this meeting, still do this at this meeting, like, got to be on time, like, half an hour before and all that. Knowing full well, like, no one else is going to be here till like, just beforehand, but... Sometimes people are, but... But... Sucking some... Manly is a weird, weird place. Nobody's there. Nobody's coming up. Zero. A car's pulling into Kangaroo Lane? Nope. Think they're gonna drive fast. 
driving past. That's what's happening. That's what they're doing. But no. So Uh, no. Who's this first? There's like a car park next to it, so... <sighs> well. How to deal with being overlooked? Well. They're parking there. That's the car park, so... Trying to reverse park here, and they're not doing a good job of it. But but but. I didn't see who that person was. I hate, I, it's not that I hate winter, it's just when it's way too cold to do anything or when the rain's like fucked up, it's just, that makes sense. It's not when you can't do anything. And I've got tattoos on my arms and I want to show that off to people, so, but. But, oh, another reason why I'm here today I don't know if she's gonna be here, but I am actually trying to take steps to be a bit more social. Um, so what? It, um, no, I don't know that person who pulled in. Uh, so anyway, um, <laughs> this is this lady I know um, in a different fellowship, and she's just gonna have coffee and all that. So what had happened was. We're gonna have coffee, and I suggest that maybe some another lady that we know to join us. Um, I was hoping to ask if she'll be. She normally comes to this meeting, but I've got a feeling she's not gonna be here today, of course. But what's gonna happen is, um, what's gonna not here? I'll just have to send her a message on Facebook or something. So. Fucking hell. But. What's going on? A little, a little bit older. So I'm so restless at the moment. I would walk, there's a cafe down the road I can actually walk to, it won't take that long, but it's Sunday, so I know it's going to be like double. The thing is, I know this is the court entry to that, but I never know that. I can never remember the code, I don't know. But what are we going to do, eh? What are we going to do? I hope the meeting is fucking on. Fucking hell, it's still, oh hang on. Yeah, it's one of the girls I've seen. Okay, okay, hang on. I, I got too restless, so I've just dropped what I'm doing and coming to a meeting. I'm outside the old Frenchs Forest meeting, um, or kind of, it's just up that way, but I've not been here in ages. So I'm kind of, I know you can't see, but that's kind of like Waker's Park, like a bit. And um, so
thought I just filmed a couple of things before I go, but no. It's kind of spooky, like this car's coming up like that, but but not really up. See, along here is like houses on the other side, but... I'm sure there's local myths, but... No. It, it is early in the night, so it's, I don't think any weird stuff is going to happen. But I wonder if it's going to be like... If there's like weird shit happens at night, but... Which, by myself, I don't want to stick around, so... But I'm having a look through the path here. Can't do it. <coughs> I know. <laughs> Waco's Park where it's filled with fucking snakes. Fucking hate it. Like, I hope this meeting's still on. I'm a bit early, so I can't really tell, but... Going back to my fucking car, because I'm weaked out. Now, there's a light on. But that could have been somebody just walking past. Somebody's pulling up. I don't know who that one. Oh. Can't see me, but still. Somebody's pulling up right next to me. But oh, I know who it is. I think Ben. Actually, don't recognise him. But there's a guy sitting in the car right next to me. But anyway, I'm feeling a lot more better. Um, since yeah, today's Monday, so um, let's get out of this car. Um, since yesterday, I felt just relieved. I'm still kind of throwing. I don't know. It kind of just feels like I'm being dumped or broken up with, or got rejected really badly by a girl. Um, okay, that person who pulled up next to me is walking towards. So it's probably I don't recognise him. So. At all. Like he's walking towards the build. I've not been to this meeting in over a year. But, any, anyway, so this, yeah, I don't want to talk about it really. I feel really embarrassed and stuff, but I hope she's okay. It's not, nothing romantic or sexually was happening. It was just some some girl and I just thought, oh, okay. The meeting, huh? Anyway, it was just, yeah, it's not a lot of shit, but it just. Nah, no, just that's how I felt for some fucking. It just got to something just got to me, and it just hurt. I'm like, but anyway, but who knows? It could be like a learning lesson for her. But I can't remember what. what oh, that's right. I can't remember which year it was, but it was one of my milestones. It just I I think it was either my ninth or tenth year. No, ninth, I think. I didn't get asked to share my milestone made in here, and there was a bunch of people like kind of had an issue with it, so. How long was it to into? But, but. Yeah, I was going to go to another meeting, but I thought this is down the road, kind of. Um. But. But I'm sure there's a lesson to listen somehow, but there you go. Oh, 
Oh, that's another reason why I stopped doing this meeting because I was going through that phase where I gotta go. Okay, I gotta be at home doing my own thing. Um. And that's the thing, okay? But I don't want to go inside and help set up for some fucking reason. I do not recognise that man that walked in the meeting. Either. I ain't gonna go in by myself, so. Oh, but I still feel a bit off and all that sort of shit, but. Yeah, it's one of the neighbours, but... But, no. Put up my friend Emma yesterday afternoon, which is cool. So, hopefully I get some sleep in and... Oh. So far, I was going to upload a new vlog today. I think I've done something with the editing thing. Um, when I was editing, when I looked at the file, it said three hours, I'm like, oh, I'll, I'll upload it like, through when I'm sleeping tonight, and when I clicked onto it, um, this morning to start promoting and shit, I realised there's like a, like an hour and a half of like, black screen, so I don't know what I've done, so I trimmed it through the YouTube, um, editor thing, but, um, so far that Reddit account didn't get shadow banned yet, so, um, which is good. Um, I gotta do a couple karma points tonight, um, which I should have done earlier, but I didn't. But I open up a window. But, who knows? I wonder what this man is like. I don't know if she's going to be here too. Uh, my friend Nicola. She said she was going to go away this week for work, I think. I think it's, yeah, it's more likely a work trip for her, but... Uh... Let me catch up, not this weekend, but the weekend after. But... Oh, that's another reason why I stopped doing this movie. I never got to share. I, I just, some, it, I really don't take things personally, initially, at all. I, of course I've had in the past, but... Normally it takes a while for me to kind of go, okay. You know what I mean? It's not what's going on here, but... So... It's currently I'm doing Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays at the cafe. Which I'll end up more likely being at... Going to stay... Would probably stay at home to do my creative stuff. He was alright, but so it looks like it's gonna be a Monday. But I got to do something about my like my schedule. I kind of let last week weekend schedule go, but no. I've really got to real. I have my own life. <laughs> I am a bit early, so not, not a lot of people are going to come up. I don't see it's like I hope they got sitting there. I feel really bad, but I just can't be fucked. I don't but going through a phase, I just don't want to help people. But
Yeah, I'll sh maybe see if I can get a visual of the fucking area since the lights are on. It's overlaying that building, so. <sighs> Overlay. See, I, I got it. I know the camera's not picking up on it, but I do have a fucking. somewhat of a decent view of the door, but. The right thing to do is to walk in and help. Uh, or at least offer to help it. Well, that's not. I'm really tired. In the wood, emotionally exhausted. I don't feel emotionally okay. That's the word I'm looking for. But. Well, this is a little. For a while, this was a neat meeting for a while. And hopefully changed as well. And when I when I say changed, I hopefully changed the like it's improved or different. this fuck somebody just pulled up next to me I don't recognize them or the car he didn't turn the car off oh okay I think he's donated there's a charity bin next to me see the red light red fly oh look at that oh. yeah he's throwing shit in the charity bin Throwing stuff to donate. Let me tell you, Ben. I'm feel confused. Fuck like now. Now he's driving off. So. Right. See, notice the, the these red lights here. See, see him driving off. There's the headlights. And he's fucking right off. That's something to be proud about when you doing things like that. Smoke. Have a cigarette. Right. It's really hard to make friends. Really hard. I think that's part of the problem. I just don't have a healthy, active life. Well, it's not always bad. I'm, like, I'm sure... If, I'm sure people died or killed to have parts of me in my life. Right. Right. Cigarettes up. <laughs> Better, like, I've been a bit more conscious with my cigarettes as well. Like internally, not, you know, today I, I wasn't, but. I but slightly making steps and changes to, to reduce the smoke. Reduce to quit. And I think another person's, I don't think they carry to me, but. After this cigarette, I'm going to go inside and help out. Oh, God. But... I should have the hate on. You know what's Gary? What's that Gary? Just walking past. 
lost. Hey, Carrie. I'll come inside in a sec. There's Carrie. Carrie's a good woman. Very healthy. She, um... She helped me out so much in early recovery. Driving me to meetings and shit like that. I'm kind of glad now. Who's this fuckface? Uh, this is Scott Arno, and I'm reporting from the Market Street bus station. Um, yeah, what you just heard was the bus station down underground, and I thought it was a good place to record because, as Kerouac would see it, it'd be the hard marble to sit on, the constant flow of buses and people, and the diversity that's there, the Chinese, the Mexicans, African Americans, all congregated in one area to go where they wanted to go and like Kerouac he went to the bus station if he couldn't find any hitchhikers in desperate need he'd take a bus to where he wanted to go and in this case to Denver his dream town and
Only manly. That's why. So I'm kind of outside work. But <coughs> I feel I feel a bit more put together, and I do have a track record of doing this of um, building myself up, doing recovery, being myself, all that stuff. Been crashing again, and that's where I got to really watch out for when I crash. Because it's not, I'm trying to put it in perspective, but I allowed something to get to me. Like I was saying before, but, which it only took maybe about, this is the third day since I felt better. So, I'm going to be a bit more conscious, particularly with the cigarettes. Um, how I carry myself, emotional health, and all that sort of stuff, but, but, I just thought I'd throw it out there. Now I have to go to the fucking toilet. Something was on my fucking way. Back of this always looks ghetto.
That's all. Oh. I turned my seat off. Did you turn it off? Yeah. Right. One more. Food. Yummy. One more food. So I'm kind of um back at the thing of world. So I'm just gonna give some updates. Not updates, but show some local tags just to see if there's any difference. Um, I'm pretty sure there's tags, but let's take a look, okay? Some paint. The thing is, I could, they're probably just fucking around. This is probably letting the paint drip and fucking around with it. Um, is that. Is that. This is just probably some fuck around. But saying stuff like that, it doesn't, it's, it's like. Yeah. I, kind of gives this a pro. Um, some more paint drippings, but. And of course, you can't go wrong without a giant penis. Two balls and... So I don't know if this white stuff here is supposed to be like that. It's the load. Um, that backdrop there is starting to oh, actually overgrow. But we'll have a look around in a sec, but... Um, some more shit. Um, some more markings. It's probably just practice or something. So, but if, if you actually, I doubt that it does, but if it actually, like, this markings here, that one there actually means something, I guess it would be cool to find out. There's another one there. Um, star, which is kind of random. Maybe it's just amateurs, but... Okay, cool. So I just noticed a couch and there's a bunny rabbit, which I just missed. So, a bunny rabbit just ran into the bush, but, which is cool to see some dumb shit here again. Let's have a look, okay? Uh, It's cool because when I was like, growing up, I used to find just like just always shit around, but it doesn't seem to happen as much. So I don't want to touch it or kick it. And the bunny rabbit's probably gone now, but this is definitely grown since looking at it properly. Uh, anyway. And just out of sight, so I didn't see that couch when I was approaching the, the, the skate park thing. But I'll probably be there for a while. Uh, also, um, maybe I should be a bit more punctual about coming here at night. But the problem is, is um, I'll just let me get it on camera first. I can hear a frog in the distance too. But it does look like people come here for fires and stuff. I don't think someone's actually living here or anything. I think it's just local kids just coming lighting fires. But the problem is I've been here once or twice, like over there. It's randomly guessing here to be at the right time in the right place. It's just a bit a bit much. I'll probably collect more dead footage than any footage worthwhile. Just thought, get that on camera. But, but it doesn't seem to be anything else, aren't we? No, nothing worth, um, you know what I mean. But it's been raining, so I can't be fucked like going through there. 
So, even though I get a shower afterwards. Right. So, I know this is a pocket over here. Um, so I don't see anything from the outside at all. Um, but I'm just on my walk, so this is why I'm here. I didn't like come all the way here to just film this. See, the, the couch is over there, the sofa, what do you want to call it? Kind of sad unless you go over that hill. Like, little side case there. But. Oh, look at that. Damn. Fucking hell. I don't know, just on top of that fence thing, there's like a kookaburra. See if I get it on camera. Can you see him? Spooked him. And nobody's using the tennis court. I wonder how much, how much um, how much are these people paying for rent? Also, I cut my finger last night. I was fucking around, and I was having a cup of coffee, and I went like right to throw the coffee, and the handle broke. I don't know why. I tried to catch catch it, and just fucking. Hell. I'm okay. I gotta survive, but it's just one of those cuts. It just won't stop bleeding. So obviously, I haven't cleaned it properly, but I'm personally gonna blame the Illuminati. So. I actually feel physically tired today, and instrumentally, it's because of the shoes that I'm wearing. Um, I need to buy new shoes. Um, I feel like a fucking child wearing this. And it's wear and tear, so look at that. Now, see? It's really thinned out. So, again. And um, my knees hurt, my ankles hurt. I've spent the last three days at the cafe. Um, old age as well. Um, and I know if I try to jog today, it's just not gonna go well for me. Um, Got it. Uh, I have to buy a new one. Maybe. So I, I am feeling better about how I've talked about. I'm a bit embarrassed and stuff. Um, but it had more to do with me probably as well. But anyway. Um, but things that I kind of been talking about, I feel a lot better. And I acted out last Sunday, and again, I kind of feels like I'm starting over again. I didn't do as much damage. In fact, I was actually still quite functioning. I just emotionally felt it, as I did other things with my life. But, um, I probably, if the way I'm doing things now, I probably won't be able to fix it until a bit closer to January, but... I did do something about, no, it's not, a bit January, um, when, at the moment, um, it's Australia's winter time, so, probably not until a bit close to the, the, to the better seasons, um, but money, i got to get back on my money game, I think, I feel it's the last year I can kind of fully live the way that I'm living, but next year I might have to be a bit, Okay, but I'll probably still do creative stuff. I gotta improve on that because if I'm gonna work during the day full time, then 
I'll, there'll probably be a lot of fucking shit that I probably won't have. I you won't be do as much. So that's probably something to adjust to and be. I guess get used to and, and then learn how to kind of like behave. I it, make use of it properly. I had another Reddit account shadow ban again because um, I was using my desktop. I think I might actually have. So I'm kind of starting over four new accounts, which I've got. Um, I just got to build up the karma points and um um. The, the, the age of the um, thing increase. Um, feels like that is, is hindering me as well. Um, um, but I think when I was working at Teddy Larrikins like two or three years ago, it was the same sort of thing. That's when I started doing like four hour vlogs and shit like that. So, I'll be probably editing something tomorrow. Um, but, I did write a few recovery notes as well to when I get home. Um, can't hold my cigarette prop because they're band aid, but probably just give it a little update. Um, but, um, Monday night's French is Frost, I'll probably go back again too. I actually really enjoyed that meeting. That night. I know I was that beating my car a bit before it, but sort of talk about it. So Yeah, I'm gonna go back home, finish my exercise routine and then drive down to the shops and get some a, a lighter. Sorry, mate, I'm distracted. That's right. I'm worth it. Dog just came out of nowhere. Scared the shit out of me. The guy seems to be, he seems to be a nice boy, but. I was gonna use this, I, it's the next day from the, anyway, um, today's Saturday, so I'm kind of like halfway through my break in the ca coffee shop, so. As you can tell, it's been fucking raining. My feet and socks are fucking wet. Um. What else? Um, what was it to say? So I was going to use this time to fucking um, um, walk down to the uh, one of the op shops in Bagala. There's a couple on the the Woolworths I go get cigarettes from. <coughs> I'm just going to buy new sneakers and shit, um, or shoes, um, and decided to um. um I, yesterday I didn't jog just because my feet and ankles and stuff were fucked up. I've got to really include stretching and shit before and after. Um, because, um, it's my, the, the back, I forgot what they called, the muscles behind your leg and shit. 
And a lot of it comes down from the new shoes, this shoe is falling apart. Um, but it's, uh, and normally there's a space that I have for Sunday afternoons so where I clean up my bedroom, do chores and stuff. And, um, and if I could buy just things randomly, like, I use that time to go. And um, But since I feel comfortable enough to go for a jog, I'll do it. I went for a jog, I tried to jog for maybe close to 40 minutes, um, but my, cause I, like I said, I need to start stretching and shit, um, it wasn't much, I just had to go call it, so, I am filling out the, t feeling, f filling out the time, to, so I'm at least walking and stuff, I'm trying to get some sort of decent, um, um, exercising so I'm gonna hang on I have to put this in a stop looks like too many people I'm allowed to film but I just feel wigged out now uh, I'm gonna put my phone back down so you can hear the, the creak but sorry that I haven't spent um not filming a different better location so <laughs> trust me I have been living my life in between these um cuts and stuff but um but they're a lot more consistent, peaceful. Um, one of these days I will probably talk a bit better about that, what, what just recently just happened. Um, but it's a bit still fresh, and I'd, but maybe later, um, which I probably will at some point. Um, but I just want to take note that, um, I've talked about it heaps of times already, but it's just good to have that sort of um, backdrop of, um, of a healthy, like having a good recovery. Um, to be fair, like it's it's been a good stream for the last, say, this is my fifth, uh, hang on, 21, 22, 20, so yeah, four years. Um, despite the stopping some like recent setbacks, like, you know, I've always gone in a cycle in my recovery um, it, since day one. Um, so, when I put my phone down, I'll have to show like a better diagram. But it's kind of, I would, but the, in simple words, two steps forward and one step back. Um, it's a very good cliche or um, saying you can use for my recovery. Um, I, I'm sure you can use that for a lot of people in recovery, but, um, um, and, but the thing is why I say consistently for four years, before it land, I'm all, look, it's it's not like a horrible experience or anything like that. It's nothing tragic, but I would go through periods of like completely letting myself go in recovery. Um, those are probably some of the bigger regrets that I have. Um, you can go back on my this YouTube channel and find videos of me kind of overweight or just unhealthy or just not not taking care of myself. I'll put it like that. Um, but it's going to be consistent. Um, Trying to be a bit more social as well. So I was a little bit more present today. I went to the curl curl meeting this morning. I was a little bit more present. Um, maybe not so much before the meeting. Um, mainly because they um, um, they don't have a lot of people helping. And since I'm capable of getting there on time, I do kind of help a lending hand. And I kind of, I don't mind it. I'm more complaining. But it, when you're doing service at a meeting, it does in a very soft, healthy, understandable way of hindering a social life, a bit of a socialization before the meeting starts, so. Um, but having said that, at least I've kind of contributed somehow. I mean, I was a bit more present. I did talk to a couple of people. It wasn't much of a conversation, but I did stop and kind of talk, but. Um, I will go be going back to the Manly meeting on Saturday afternoons. Um, uh, I will be going back to the uh, probably from next week. Um, but I am going to the hardball one tonight. Um, but, yeah. Look 
Fucking see some spots there, and uh, just a spot there. But fucking hell. Slows down down here, doesn't it? So, looks like at least for now, I have decided to just use the, the, the Reddit app. I should have started using it earlier, but I just didn't think about it for my YouTube channel. So, and when I get home from this, I'll be <coughs> downloading it just to get the um, jits and karma points and um, build up. But it sucks, you know, the last three months of just not fucking getting anywhere with it. But, happy and fucking Facebook, sort your shit out too. But, um, what else can I say? So, um, But uh, try to continue to sort of live a healthy life. So, healthy mind, healthy character, healthy emotions equals a healthy life. So, I don't know anyone fool you of that. Yeah. Like a mother nature for you. But, Yeah. I'm gonna have a cigarette soon. Oh yeah, I was just gonna talk about my smoking, so let me see. I think she's crying. I hope she's okay. But Check this out. Uh, it doesn't look as good in camera as it does in person. Fucking puddle, this is why my fate's wet too. Alright, I am going to venture home slight, slightly a bit different today. Um, the smoking. Um, late tonight, I probably would have to kind of buy another packet maybe. Um, but I just want to make a distinction. It's mainly because the the physical withdrawals <coughs> from it, um, rather than mental and, and, and my just being frantic and anxiety induction. But um, 
Maybe it's just fucking COVID. I just got in the habit of every two or three days of just buying like two packets in one day <coughs> and chain smoking. Um, I've always had that problem. Um, um, <coughs> so I, you know, I, I can remember like going through periods and stuff. Um, so. But, trying to follow through, a bit of practice as well. <coughs> um, so, I'm actually trying to space out my Smith cigarettes and it's enough. Um, and this is something fucked up happens in life. I feel actually pretty good about it. So, there's just a couple of houses here that fascinate me. One of it's that one there, with, the, with that thing in the front yard. Um, and this house here, that one fascinates me there. It just has character to it, so. Um, but today it just seems more of the physical part why I'm kind of a bit more looser with it. Um, since COVID started, I've just been going through a lot of cigarettes and stuff. Um, and I've got to cut that out. So, so it's finally getting through to me at 11 years clean and sober from drugs and alcohol. It's it's. It's expensive here in Australia, it's unhealthy, it smell, it's a bunch of other shit. And um fucking hell. Check out this house too. Look at that. Fucking hell. So I don't know who, this house has been not just left unattended, so. Um, and finally got cleared up a bit. I'm sure it's been on my, um, not featured, I want to say featured, but spotted on my blog. I don't know, I doubt that somebody actually lives in there, but. Um, so also like a couple of houses behind me as well, I've got character too. <laughs> when I was a kid, I swear every park was just like that, but, um, but, I'm just throwing that shit, to, like, don't wait too long to kind of grow up, and not, I've grown up, but to kind of work on yourself as well, it's, that kind of makes sense, um, oh, fucking stepping in mud. I don't know if you can hear that, but oh, fucking hell, the world's against me. Um, so I don't know if I'm making any sense if you can actually get anything from this, but um, I can hear water flowing too. Um, since it's daylight. Um, Have a walk. I don't know if I can get a good walk from it though. Oh. Maybe. Nah. No, I'd be fucked, so. Oh, which way to go? Okay. Me and my mate Dave was around here. Anyway. But, like I said, mind, emotions, and character 
equal a good life. But having that balance between living your life, developing, and some leisure can do a lot of a lot of work for you. So who knows? But and even though people might not care or notice, but um, you'll be leaving behind a good <laughs> I was going to sit in the car and just talk for a bit, but kind of about roughly about half an hour early. Um, I'm outside, going to do the, oh, you want to be able to see from here, but kind of behind that grass and stuff is the Curl Curl um, Community Centre. I am going to, um, just was going to sit here and talk for a bit, but since I'm here, I may as well give something a bit different, a little bit different to help give the, oh, not a break, but I've, the last few minutes and stuff, I've been um, filming myself exercise, and that's really weird to say, but um, I know there's like a walking path um, to the Oval, so may as well um, um, have a look, okay? And after the meeting, which I'll probably get home just after 5pm, um, um, I'm just going to relax, and hopefully, I, I, don't, I'm not gonna fu- I can't be fucked talking about it, but... Yeah, because I'm fucking just need tired. Right, anyway, let's have a look again. Okay? It's gonna fucking rain any minute too. So I left my wallet in the car, got my cigarettes. Let's see what's the hat. But you know life can be good sometimes, but, but so, yeah, there's not like a lot of kids and shit around, which is good. I am in public, but it's just fucking, um... I'm always uncomfortable about filming around families and shit, but... Um, so... Sporting field... Stuff. The lagoon is like... Just over there. I'm sure that I'll get footage of it. But... Baseball. To soccer. Netball is down further. I'm not too sure about um, if they play other sports and stuff, but. So the grass is kind of wet, but um, who knows? So uh, it's wet, but not fucking soggy and shit. But. Because of the green just there, it, um, um, it's got a weird smell, but, <coughs> probably a few snakes around. And I just had this I, I, I'm not going to talk about it, anyway. So I don't know, the last, I, I got a little bit of this area last time I did this, I think, but I'm not too sure about this baseball field. It's there and it happens here in Australia. Um, I know the Northern Beach has got a couple spots here, and I think it's um, French's Forest as well, which is just off Waco's Parkway. Um, I know St. Ives area has got a t-ball baseball sort of community there but I, baseball's not really a thing here in Australia because um but fuck for that sand and shit but to be honest um I'm sure this shit happens around this area but I'm just never here But, anyway, um, some kids behind me. I'm gonna keep an eye out on them. 
<sighs> fucking popular for the dogs and shit. You got like all the white people live over there. Tja. There was a teenager who was walking kind of behind me. He just walked in the bushes. But, um, in brackets, unknown reasons, but. Um, so I think, or maybe I walked on the path, maybe there's a path in those bushes and shit, but I don't know. Cause I can't remember if I actually got So I was about to say, the fuck is that? It's a fucking frog. No, it's a frog statue. It's fucking weird. Some gypsy shit there. Oh, I think there is a path, and that's what I did last time. And I think I got about roughly about up to here, then turned back because the meeting was about to start. But anyway, oh, cricket. There's a cricket pitch there. So white people live over there. Um, the netball fields are just there in the playground. There's a few families there. Gotta pay attention because um, it's muddy. Um, no, I don't know if there's a path there. I don't know. Confusion myself. So, and then, yeah, I have kind of filmed on the other side of the lagoon there, but. Um, so it's a good family area to be honest. It is actually pretty safe and whatnot, but oh, just not paying attention. So um, I'm gonna have a look around here. There's just some kids, so I'm not really particularly spooked about that. Um, So, oh, okay, there is no path there. Um, to be honest, some kids are probably built like a home. Um, I hope some kids built that. It'd be weird if someone else did that. Okay, some dude up there was taking a piss, so he's gone. Um, oh, cigarette time. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh. Okay, there's two paths. Um, I'm gonna go this way, just because. Now there's the lagoon, it's dried up and shit. But... <clears throat> I really don't expect to find weird stuff. It's more kind of like uh, parties or grommets and stuff for teenagers. Um, you'll probably end up saying, that's what I mean. Um, I don't know about snakes and shit just because it's so popular with people and snakes are more probably fearful of people than we are of them. But you do have to be careful though, regardless. And this is why you... <sighs> yeah, hang on. Winter time is no snakes, but you gotta deal with shit like that. That's the thing. I can bullshit. Mud. <sighs> So, looks pretty cool, hey, if you're into the stuff. I'm gonna watch out for this kid. Um, there was a path here, I'm gonna have a look. Which is not worth going over. Nah, it's not even worth coming down here. But, no, should have just turned back, sorry guys. Um, I gotta jump with this. <coughs> Did it, James Bond shit. Uh, I'm gonna have a look around here. Oh, 
fucking disgusting shit. Okay, I've never been up here, so let's have a look. Oh, this is cool, actually. Ben chickens. Yeah, there's the bridge there, I've been there. Those white birds have been chickens. Oh. Yeah. Fucking hell. Maybe these folks only come out when the tide's low. Anyway. Ducks, I think. I think they're ducks. Yeah. Let's keep exploring. The fuck is that? There's a brick. So, the paths look a bit more dodgy. Not dodgy, but um, not used. I put it like that. So, but it's pretty really weird. I'm a Adult man, kids are over there, I've got my camera out and I'm in the bush. So but maybe I should turn back just because. Okay, and it brought me nowhere. So, yeah, I, I'm surprised I definitely been on that bridge, but I don't remember saying this, but but look at that, you can't feed the dogs. The fuck was that? Look how dirty the water is. Fucking filthy. And what the fuck is that too? There's a few ducks around. Um, yeah, some of these water bottles though. But I guess it's cool. During summertime. There's the other side there. So. Another. I don't know what that building is. There's like people with rollerblades too and their um, families and shit. So. It's cool fun, hey? It's like I said, good for families. Cox viewing deck. There's not much, I just kind of walked past it. French family right behind me, so I felt really uncomfortable having my phone out, but past. But it kind of goes a bit further. There's some more the space. The creek pretty much just looks like it. The last fair few meters like this. Um, not much, unless you want to go like in the bushes and shit but it uh, doesn't excite me I can hear music in the distance I think it's music or something um, I'm glad that I got here to be honest to realize it's cool but I don't know I'm sure there's shit to do but um, the path just keeps going um, now the car park, but I'm sure I've been on that other side. Right. So we'll get just over here. Um, 
more likely or not, I'll probably end up turning back, but um, resting bench. To be honest, it'll probably be, be better during summertime. Um, when I was a kid, I played rugby on that field. Just fucking remembered. But, um, fuck, that was years ago. When I was a teenager, sorry. But, um, there might be weird spots to do. A spot to do weird stuff around here. But I'm just thinking for myself. Um, <coughs> but, um, that's, so that's a, that's a rugby field. And there's another one just above there. <coughs> there's another bridge just here, so. Um, I'll cross the bridge, but there's a rock there. Um, trees to climb. It'll be good for kids and shit, but um, typical Sydney, though. I think mixture of nature and white people, I guess. But dog walking approved. So I didn't give myself enough time, I and mean, I'm not going to come up here just to fucking. Up and down the path. So this is Curl Curl. Um, just if you want to do people like carve shit into it. So. Um, fuck, the water's so fucking dirty. Look how dirty that shit is, see? on the other side there's AFL being played. Shit there. Can car driving too. So a little bit of a tour. Um I was gonna actually sit there and talk but I just gonna be fucked just sitting there talking but cool cool it'll be cool in the summer or with friends. Just wanna go for like a walk. The water's fucking dirty. Um, good for families, um, too many white people, um, whew, what else, oh, I'm only going back because I'm kind of running out of time, um, probably put the phone down in a second and have a cigarette, <coughs> um, yeah, it's alright, but, because i got to drive here and all that, and it's a bit of an awkward spot, even with that. Um, doubt that I'll ever come back um, because of that drive, but... Anyway, um, the Illuminati's real, aliens are real, and the government killed JFK. Right, I'm back. I'm not back, but still... But I am going to light a cigarette up. Light it up, light it up, light it up. Because I just started doing my recovery week and I'm going to be a bit more present. That. So. But. Shit, it's gonna be fucking wet. Like, I didn't think this through, hey. <coughs> we'll blame the government for this, man. But, but, I can help. So I just might give a brief update. <coughs> yeah.
yesterday wasn't the <coughs> <coughs> fucking cigarettes. Um, yesterday wasn't the best war managed anxiety day. It was just out of my control. Things weren't working out. I think that's not going to be the sign of the uh, um, day. So, yesterday I didn't have the best things. Like that. It, it wasn't like as bad as it was before, but it's just one of those days that things weren't working out for me. Um, so, my cigarette wasn't, uh, my cigarette practice wasn't the best, but. So. But. See what happens though. But today I didn't um, walk to work. I decided to sleep in a bit. It is kind of a more rest week, so it's bound to happen from time to time. But hopefully in the next two days I'll be able to kind of um, recenter and shit like that. But um, back to rebuilding um, subreddits again as well. but. It's just frustrating, in the last three or four months I can't do shit done. But, you know, maybe next week I can start popping off a bit. Not popping off, but, um, who knows, mate. But, you know, it happens though, so. <coughs> so, I've kind of um, had a moment to myself to try to do some recovery practice. By just sending myself and all that. Um, try to be a bit more practice internal stuff. Um, since I am trying to reduce my cigarettes, um, there's a tobacconist um, here in Manly that um, you can actually buy stuff for like 20 bucks and stuff. So I thought they pack it to 20s. So, so I thought I'd just do that. Hopefully, use work to my advantage and help space out the time throughout the day. I might give myself a, a little bit of a leeway towards this afternoon, but um, after work tonight, I might actually just, um, not so, oh, I might do that when I'm walking home, actually. Um, this last week um, when I was here working, I was actually trying to pace myself a bit, but in the afternoon it was a bit hard. Uh, but, but walking home, I can probably do that with the cigarettes, walking home. Um, social life, n n nothing happening at the moment. But. See how it goes with it, the Reddit stuff, that's really starting to get to me, the Reddit stuff. But. I'm not, probably not going to edit it, anything soon. Um, I am probably going to organise a bunch of the footage tonight when I get home. Um, not edit it up, organise it, like set it all up for me. Um, maybe think about, think it a bit over, see what i got to do. Might do a Zoom meeting tonight. Oh, Alanon, that's right. She, today's Tuesday, so. So I might do that on Zoom. Um, but try to practice and stuff as well. Yep. Yep, you know. I released another book of poetry last night. Um, Amazon links in the description box thing, but. It might not be my poetry thing, but one of them, a link will be there. But, but, okay, oh. had some coffee.
Okay, I just had an alarm. I just had another dose of empathy. Yeah. Um, generally when I see, uh, I'm not going to describe it, some people with glasses on, they remind me of an, a, a, a girl that I was with. So, and whenever I see, I see somebody with, like, kind of looks like my, that woman, it just reminds me of, like, just be kind to people, but, like, who knows. I don't know. Not that person was. Also, I gotta slow down my cigarettes as well, like when I'm actually smoking. See on the other side. Yeah, it's our right idea. Somebody's parking their car just there. Survived the night buying that um, a packet of twenties. It lasted me till I actually went to bed. Um, Um, this week I decided actually not to kind of walk to the cafe because I could have, seems like I just could have rest my body. But, I thought I'd come here because it seems a bit more quieter.
that. Door making one on one. As soon as you want to film, life outside happens, but. Um, today I'm not too sure how today is going to be. I think I might be slightly a bit more relaxed. I'm still going to have the intent of trying to be slowly cut down um, my cigarettes. So. Also, I've been having this sleep thing, like, I go to sleep and I wake up, like, in three or four hours time, just be, <coughs> and eventually, I think that's what's causing the fucking, when I wake up in the morning, like, that sort of, my body being tired and all that, but, like, So, this morning I did have a moment when I was waiting for the bus. Help clear my vibes. Help clear, you know, gain some sort of centeredness and stuff. I even read a couple of Bible verses and stuff about wisdom and. But. No. Um. But who knows, man? Fascinating what disappointment and pain can do to a person. So, so clearly I'm the. I know I said I'd be mindful of vlogging too much at Manly, but I think it's a garbage truck. I'm hearing some sort of truck. But. I love coffee. Love coffee so much. But I might have to give Tardy up, my beard my tardy up. I think I was actually thinking about it this morning. I've seen, I've seen Danielle like twice since coming back to the Emporio. Last year I've seen her all the fucking time. But, anyway. I should have a look at the message thread and see the last time I made him go through. But, anyway. Should be drunk in the afternoon, so it's not like fucking. Interact with it. But... Yeah, I need to trim. Jot it down. After go to the toilet now. So annoying. So it's pretty good that I able to take a shit just then. But.
I'll have a cigarette. Come on. Ha, <laughs> So I just wanted to <coughs> give a brief update. Um, so I listened kind of speaking about it. Today I was probably a bit more relaxed with my cigarettes than I was yesterday at work. Um, yesterday I was a bit more kind of like no pace them out, pace them out part and I was able to actually follow through on it. Today I was a bit more uh, liberal as you can say. Um, I've got a lot more personal control since not being at work. Um, I'm actually clearly heading home now, um, so for the rest of the evening, I'll probably, I've still got a few cigarettes left, um, yeah, a good small handful, um, I doubt it will get me through, it might, um, um, 
Actually, yeah, I'm, the road's just there, so I might actually walk down a bit more. Um, actually, the audio's not okay. So, I'm a bit more at this spot. So, it's probably... Recently, it's probably been overused a bit, but... Um, fuck. Right, as soon as I start recording, there's other people coming down, but... Um, I have to put it down away in a bit. The other is a bit better, so so once I get home, I'm not gonna fucking um probably be too busy and shit, but um so my relationship to cigarettes has been <laughs> very mixed, yeah. I love it and hate it. It's like I really love smoking, um, and only ex-smokers get that. Um, or current smokers, <laughs> they are people too. But um, uh, ever since COVID, I've had probably I'll buy, I'll go through a whole packet. This is every couple of days, and whole one whole packet, um, and go and then buy another one. Sometimes throughout that day. Um, I, I'm a heavy smoker, I've chain smoked, so um, I think a lot of it too. Um, okay, I'm gonna go home. Is it, somebody's just ended the pot. I'm gonna go get a coffee. Make it, make it coffee. to set up just to do simple things. At least it looks different from now. <coughs> I'm I got riders block and it's just 
The whole afternoon is since I got home. I've been thrown into a fucking frenzy. I can't focus, I can't do shit. My computer's my computer's not working, it's slowing down. Oh, I should do that. Sorry about that, but so I think when I'm thinking about like so anxiety just not happening. I've got writer's block, I'm not focusing, I feel fat, I wasn't present, I blah blah blah. So just then, um, I thought I'd go with, like a walk around the block. That's not, it's helping, but it's not doing its job. So, I'm not having anxiety because of the rise block, but it's just one of those moments and what nothing's working out. So, so I'm stopping. I think it's a, not a bad, a bad person might, might be a bit too strong, but. A bit of kind of like two step forward, step back type of internal reaction, if that makes sense. And gave it in. Want to go buy some cigarettes tonight? Hopefully tomorrow I can start again. Right, I'm trying to, to reset myself though. But oh yeah, so I'm a heavy smoker, yes as, as you can probably tell and <laughs> so I'm trying to adjust myself internally, take the small, very small steps forward. <laughs> Just start reducing the amount of times I'm smoking. But fuck, man, at 11 and a half years, it feels good to kind of do it. Uh, at least I'm recognizing that sort of anxiety provoking thing. And um, yeah, I think it's just little things just get into me as well. So, so but in a few minutes I'm gonna head down to Manly. Cause life is fun. So, finally a bit set. I drive down. Fuck it. I do not feel that. <sighs> One more step. This night is just not working out for me, so. So tomorrow morning, <coughs> I'll have a lot left over of time I'm, it's like 9 o'clock at night, I'll be probably trying to go to bed in less than 3 hours. On the way home, like, 
what I was doing at the, when I was talking in the back deck, I got reminded to, uh, cause my computer was heaps slow, slowing down, nothing was, so that was added to the problem. So, so when I was having that cigarette on the deck, talking to the camera, vlogging, I'm like, oh, maybe I should turn the computer off for a little bit and then I'll turn it back on. So I went to turn it back on, it had to completely reset and it, I just got, I cracked it, I said, fuck this. And, um, so, and it's just, I don't know, it's just, it's just a night. Once I get to sleep and, anyway, so tomorrow when I'm here, I'm trying to save some money too, and this is the, the main reason. What's contributing to is the money factor. So, got to fucking do it. So, right, so tomorrow I'm gonna buy another twenty the imported smokes. Um, hopefully, I'm gonna miss out on skipping some meals to for the, the remainder of this week. And uh, the reason why is so I can fucking um. Have a bit of extra. Oh, hang on. Extra cash when I'm fucking um when I get paid next Monday, and hopefully slow down. So I'll be alright. I just calm myself down and fucking who knows, man. Uh, If that makes am I making sense? But like it doesn't hit me, but when it hits me, it hits me strong. All this shit. It's Tuesday night, so man, it's not going to be popping up at all. So fucking hell, man. So. Oh yeah, mentioning um, Charlie Veitch, <coughs> I'm not conflicted, but I, I am mixed about him, like, because I've seen videos he's just fucking attention shaking and stuff of that nature, but, so, yeah, so, well that's just my, Away, we are sort of the bin, but I don't know. See, look at this. Hang on, it's added more power to it. Oh, so Town Horse got blue lights too. No, no, no. If bars, you know what it is. Oh no, I'll, I'll 
put it, uh, if that's what you wanted to hear, it's, I'm just throwing it out there for you, it's, uh, I'm just throwing it out there for you, if that's what you wanted to hear, it's, I'm pretty good at it, like, just trust me, I'm sure, Yeah, it seems, yeah, it seems pretty sweet. Uh, he mentioned it. Yeah, I think it's just, yeah, so I, That's what you want to do. That's what you want to do. Yeah, if you know what it is, and yeah, I think this. No, no, actually, this is. Don't just go. Like an hour of Danielle just then, so which is alright. But she seems alright, handling things well. But anyway. Cigarette. Having one cigarette, then sending myself to bed. So I ran into Danielle, which is fucking random. Have have a bit of a chat. Just about an hour or so. So. Fuck man, she's gonna adventure.
Fucking hell, man. Anyway. Watch me have a cigarette. Get off the dead zone. Some people live some really sad. <laughs> when you get past 30 and continue to make poor choices in life, fuck man. You're gonna live a very sad life, but. Put it like that. Oh, it's maybe it's hot. Maybe I shouldn't put my phone there. Fucking hell, my computer's still cleaning up. I thought when I left, it was just... Fucking hell. Oh. Left myself notes and stuff. So I see it in the morning. Fucking hell. That's what was causing me problems tonight. I have to write this night off. It's okay when I've actually produced and done stuff, but I guess I am recording some footage and shit. Fucking hell. I hate nights like this, days like this all nights, I just say. It is night time. Just how do you control it? Day fucks up. But just letting you know that like, if this was happening in early recovery or my years of active addiction, I would have just given up and just go fuck it. And months later, like, it's kind of like, why did I give up? But I was so retarded when I was growing up. going on. Fucking hell. Come on Google. Who's the owner to Google? That's what I want to know. Um, oh. I've got a headache. There's always like one spot, like, whenever I go like, through like a bad period and stuff, there's always like one little slap in the fucking face. Fucking oh, hell. I'll have to go another cigarette after this. Uh,
you know, it's good to see Daniel. Uh, it's been a while since I actually spent any time with her. I see a while actually. Um, planning up 100% complete. The thing is, it says 100% complete of planning up. Um, it is not doing anything. Uh, it's the Illuminati. Let's blame that. Um, Fucking dirty clothes. Clothes. So tomorrow morning when I wake up, so tomorrow morning when I wake up before the cafe, I'm good to go. So it's not like six o'clock in the morning going, mm, what the fuck is everything? Um, you know what type of person I'm jealous of? If something bad happens to him. And they can kind of like grieve Thor out emotionally and discontinue. I don't know. That's the type of person I'm jealous of. I'm getting better at this as well, like actually looking at my schedule too. So. Still going on. Right here. Fucking hell, still going. That's what I'm talking about. It just hold. To be fair, most of the time when shit hits the, the fan for me, it happens all at once instead of like a bit here, a bit there. But it sucks when it's happening, but. My computer's gonna be okay. Cause I got like hours of hours of footage on it.
really frustrating, especially when, when things I can't do anything about, are, that sucks more. But when I actually can kind of help contribute to, to make things right, or do something, that's a lot more easier. But, that makes sense. Hopefully time I finish this cigarette. Let's get this up and running. Um. I got one minute. Let's see if this works. Turn this off first. Oh, well, I've done it on iTunes. Okay. It's finally up, back and, up and running. Right. Hopefully, this is all. Well, it took fucking forever.